classifier naive base classifier hello 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 ఎవరమ్మ మీ స్టూడెంట్ మాన్స ఉంది ఆంటి మధ్యలో వాళ్ళ అమ్మగారిని మాట్లాడుతున్నాను ఈ రోజు మా అబ్బాయిది పెళ్లి కుదిరింది ఒక రెండు గంటలు పర్మిషన్ ఇస్తారా అండి సరే అమ్మ తినేసి తను ఏ మానస ఏ ఇద్దరు మానస టీ మానస అవునండి సరే అమ్మ సరే అండి yesterday's class we have seen optimal base classifier optimal base classifier so in optimal base classifier what we have seen that if the target values if the target values are v is equal to a set of vj then the probability of classifying the given data as vj the probability of classifying the data as vj is sigma h i belong to the hypothesis space h the probability of v j the hypothesis h i into that hypothesis the and we will classify as when this expression gives the maximum probability of vj given the hypothesis this is called base classification or optimal base classification or otherwise we can call this as the optimal base classification so in yesterday's class we have taken three hypothesis h1 h2 h3 where the posterior probability of h1 was 0.4 
the posterior probability of h2 is 0 0.3 and the posterior probability of h3 is also 0 0.3 is 0.3 and because this has most maximum prior pro posterior probability we call that as the map hypothesis what is map hypothesis Pinalo? what is map hypothesis Hello, are you there? Yes, sir. Um, what is map hypothesis? Hmm? Map a posterior hypothesis most probable hypothesis so we have taken an example where an instance x is classified positive by h1 and negative by h2 and h3 in that situation to know whether it is positive or negative we will calculate the probability of positive and negative so the probability that it is classified as positive is sigma probability that it is classified as positive by an hypothesis into the probability the posterior probability of that hypothesis given the data so this is equal to the probability of classified by positive by H1 is 1 into the posterior probability of H1 is 0 0.4 because H2 and H3 are classifying it as negative the probability of classifying the given example as positive by h2 is 0 similarly the probability of classifying the given example as positive by h3 as also 0 so 0 into 0.3 plus 0 into 0.3 is equal to 0.4 0 0 gets cancelled similarly negative sigma because h1 is classifying it as positive the probability that h1 classifies the example as negative is 0 so 0 into 0 0.4 and the probability of classifying this example as negative by h2 is 1 by h3 is 1 so 0 0.3, 1 into 0.3 plus 1 into 0.3. So that means 0 0.6. So we will classify the given x as negative by using base 
optimal classifier so base classifier is one of the best classifiers in the field of machine learning which is one of the accurate classifiers given the same hypothesis given the same training examples base will give you the best result than any other classification methods any other classification method now in the base there is one more classifier which is called naive basis classifier what is the meaning of naive pillalo what is the dictionary meaning of naive What is the meaning of naive? Don't know anything. Innocent, right? Yes, sir. Innocent. Why it is called naive? I will discuss tomorrow. My net is slow. It seems. They are connected in the. state of Okay. Am I audible? Yes, sir. Uh, is my screen is shared? Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. So tomorrow in the next class, I will discuss why it is called naive. Uh, but today I will take a numerical example, and we will see how this naive Bayesian algorithm works how this naive bayesian algorithm works now let us say uh, there is uh, better we take some let me take our uh, id3 algorithm problem where we have how many attributes yes great
okay how many attributes are there four four attributes are there based on these four attributes suppose we are given with new tuple or new set of attributes for example let us say there is an example sunny cool humidity high wind is strong so outlook is sunny temperature is cool humidity is high wind is strong do we have any tuple here in the training in the 14 examples like this no sir no we don't have so now we have to classify this example this data either s or no we should answer whether this is s or no by using naive bayes algorithm so what are this outlook temperature humidity wind we call them as attributes we call them as attributes we call them as attributes now if you have a set of attributes a1 a2 a3 so on a n this is your set of attributes and you have target values v j what is our target values here what is the set of v yes sir no so that means v j is either s or no then we can from the bayes theorem we can say that the maximum um, let us say small v here rather than capital v maximum a posteriori classification or hypothesis for s or no is the maximum where vj belongs to capital v the probability of vj of attributes a a1 a2 a3 so on a n a n and from the bayes theorem what we can write is v map is equal to arg max of vj given a1 a2 a3 so on so forth this is small v so according to the bayes theorem 
probability of a given b is equal to probability of b given a into the probability of a the prior probability of a by the probability of b isn't it the bayes theorem because we are trying to maximize this we can eliminate this denominator we can eliminate this denominator and we can say v map is equal to arg max of probability a1 a2 so on an what are as here attributes of attributes given the target value into the probability of that particular target value now because uh we are assuming that assuming that this a1 a2 a3 are all individual they are not dependent on each other isn't it uh outlook temperature humidity wind manam iskune values assuming that they are independent actually independent kakapochu but okay we can assume that safely independent of each other then we can calculate this probability of a1 a2 so on an given vj can be estimated as the product of p of a1 vj into p of a2 vj so on the probability of a and vj how do we express the product chapandi if it is summation we write sigma if it is product we write big pi pi i of course 1 to n let us say yeah so the naive basis bayes algorithm the naive bayes principle naive bayes principle principle principal gaadu principal ante college lo unde pedda aina ani principal ante pedda aina principle ante sutram chaala saarlu even after final years chaala mandi certificate letter rastaru aa letter rasinappudu to the an rasinappudu nenu chusan 60% vallu principal an rastunnar principal ante sutram principal ante pedda aina okay so remember that so what is naive bayes principle substitute here v map or v naive basis naive bayes 
is equal to maximum of vj belongs to capital v this probability of a1 a2 so on an vj can be written as the product of i is equal to 1 to n the probability of ai by vj into the probability of vj this is called naive bayes principle naive bayes principle very very important very very important now coming to the our example here the question is here the question is we are given with new instance already we have training examples how many training examples we have how many training examples we have how many 14 14 training examples we have now we are given with a new instance we are given with new instance what is that instance that instance is outlook is equal to hmm sunny comma temperature is equal to cool humidity is equal to high and wind is strong this is our instance we want we have to classify this whether in this situation he will play the tennis or not yes or no we should be saying wind is strong this is the training this is the instance new instance based on the training data we have to calculate so now we have to calculate what for each attribute we have to calculate a j a j ai kada sorry ai vj that means the probability of sunny yes the probability of sunny given that he plays tennis then the probability of cool given yes then the probability of humidity high ikkada meer kavalante adi kuda raasukochu humidity is equal to high given s yes. probability of wind is equal to strong to for the simplicity 
I am omit omitting that. Play tennis is yes. We have to calculate all this, and we we should know what is the probability of yes. What is the probability of yes? Out of fourteen. Out of fourteen. Out of fourteen, how many are yes? Tell me. How many are yes and how many are no? How many? Nine are yes. Eight are sorry. Five are no. So what is the probability of yes? Nine. Nine by fourteen, isn't it? The probability of yes is nine by fourteen. How much? How much? Point six four. What is the probability of no? Five by fourteen. How much? Point three five. Point three five. So similarly, we have to calculate what is the probability of sunny no. What is the probability of sunny no? What is the probability of cool no? What is the probability of high no? What is the probability of strong and no? Then we have to multiply it with. The no probability. So first, we'll calculate the positive probabilities. So that means the probability of outlook is equal to sunny. And play tennis. Is yes. This is we want. This actual guy, the Narada. To simplify, I have written like this. But actually, this is the thing. So now, first of all, out of fourteen. How many examples have the outlook is equal to sunny? How many examples have outlook is equal to sunny? How many? Five. Then Excel what is now? No, make exam like Excel on that do. You have to be uh, somewhat uh, be able to do it without Excel. Hmm. How many? Five. Five, right? Five examples. In out of this five, how many are yes? Two. Two. Two are yes. Three are no. No. So here. Yes, are two, and total yes examples are nine. So the probability of outlook is sunny and play tennis. Yes, is two by nine. How much? How much, Amma? Point double two. Ah, point double two. Similarly, probability of outlook is 
equal to sunny given that play tennis is no how many examples are there three or no and totally how many examples no five five so zero point six kada zero point six so similarly calculate for all the probability of next what is the pro, uh, cool temperature is equal to cool given that play tennis we are calculating probability of ai given vj given yes given no so equal to s now let us see the data if you see the data temperature cool how many examples are there four examples out of four three are positive one is negative three are positive one is negative so what is the probability 3 by 9 three are positive and total positive are 9 so 3 by 9 1 by 3 0.33 and similarly p temperature is equal to cool play tennis is equal to no what most another most is there another most another most huh? yeah i brought it i brought it i kept it somewhere see there uh, there is there should be a most maybe in your bag hmm maybe i brought it so what is the probability one no and total nos are 5.2 next probability of humidity high where is my bag did you get it yes see my bag humidity is equal to high given that play tennis is equal to yes give see the data humidity high total examples are 7 out of 7 how many yes 3 3 yes 4 no Four no total seven. So three s yes, four no equal to three by total s yes, or nine probability is point three three. Next probability of humidity. equal to high 
given that play tennis is no four examples are there and total no examples are five so the probability is 0.8 hmm? Maybe they're only. Point eight. Now the last one. Probability of wind is strong. Play tennis is yes. So go to the data. Wind is strong. How many examples? How many examples totally? Six examples. How many positive? How many negative? Three negative, three positive. Are you following? So three by nine, again point three three, and Given play tennis equal to no is three by five, that is equal to point six. Now, according to the naive base, what is the maximum probability of positive? Classifying it as a positive is the pi p a i positive into probability of s. Sorry, not positive, rather, yes. Mali Radhama. Yes, into probability of yes. That means probability of sunny and a mali matam yani, a black color loan yani, into probability of yes. So tell me what are the Black color probabilities here under the yes, sir. Point two two. Point two two into the probability of temperature cool and yes is point three three. into 0.33 tell me what is the value of this into the probability of s is the probability of s is 0.64 isn't it 
probability of s is 0.64 what is this value probability of sunny yes probability of cool yes probability of high humidity high yes probability of wind strong yes into the probability of yes this is what we calculated tell me the value point point double zero five zero Am I audible? Yes, sir. Hello, hello. Okay. What is the value? Point What is the value? Five. Point double zero. Five zero. Point double zero five. Five. Five zero zero. Five zero. okay something like similarly what is the value that we will classify it as negative that means the probability of sunny and no into the probability of cool and no into the probability of high humidity high and no given no into the probability of the probability of wind strong and no into the probability of no So, what are the values here? The probability of sunny and no is point six, point two, point eight, point six, point six into point two into point eight into point six, point two into point six into the negative probability no. Prior probability of no is point three five, and what is this value? Point zero two zero. Point zero two zero. Good. So. right which is more 
positive classification or negative classification which is the maximum we want the maximum negative. according to the naive basis so which has the maximum negative or positive negative sir hmm ma ee renditlo heri pedadha ma negative sir negative so this x is classified as negative that means play tennis no he will not play tennis in the given situation so this is naive base algorithm name base classification name base classification okay tomorrow we'll take another example and calculate it